Hi everyone, it's me, Miss Angie, and I'm with Miss Doris. Hello. <laughs> and today we are gonna make a craft and talk about iHeartRadio that's coming up pretty soon. And Miss Doris is gonna read us a story so we know exactly when it is. Um, it's about music. So our craft today, we're gonna make a musical instrument. So I'm gonna have Miss Doris start by reading us a story so we know exactly why we're making our instrument today. All right, Miss Doris, read us the story. Okay, I Heart Radio Music Festival. The I Heart Radio Music Festival is September 18th and 19th. The host of the music fest festival is Ryan Seacrest. Everybody knows who Ryan Seacrest is, I think. Definitely. American Idol. Yes. <laughs> The music festival is usually in an arena. Many music fans usually go to the arena. They watch popular singers and bands perform. Maybe your Taylor Swift will be there, boys and girls. I know everybody loves Taylor Swift. The music festival will be different in 2020. People cannot gather because of the coronavirus. Music fans can watch the singers and bands online. The singers and bands include Miley Cyrus, Usher, Coldplay, and BTS. Good variety. Will you watch the iHeartRadio Music Festival? There's the story. Thank you, Miss Doris. So I'm sure everyone's gonna watch because we all love music, right? So we are gonna get started on our craft and make our musical instrument that you can use during music class here at school and when you watch the iHeart Radio show. You can play along. So in the background, we're gonna play some Usher to give us some background music, right? As we're right. making our craft. So we're gonna hit play on that. So we have a little background music. <laughs> All right, so what you need, super easy guys, you're going to need some beans or rice, whatever you have at home in your pantry. You're going to need some plastic Easter eggs. You can get them at the dollar store, a party center, anywhere, just those little plastic eggs. Some plastic spoons and some duct tape. Any kind of tape you have at home will work. All right, so Miss Doris, here you go. She's gonna start with one egg and she's gonna just take a little handful of beans and put them right inside the egg. And this is a great activity if you have a helper, right? That's perfect. Okay, I'm gonna close the egg. Yep, and perfect. I snap shut. So I'm gonna give Miss Doris a little tape just to tape around the edges of the egg, just so when you're really getting into your music and shaking, it doesn't explode everywhere, right? So let me give her a little piece of tape. Yes, yeah, scissors could help. I'm just going around. Don't forget to dance while you're making your musical instrument, right? Okay, okay that's step two. Excellent. Now you're just gonna put two spoons on the sides and we're gonna put a piece of tape around the spoons at the top and then a little bit on the bottom. And I'm gonna be creative and go red and white. Excellent. This is where you might need help for someone to tape. <laughs> yes, and scissors work best. You know what? I'm going to switch my food, my spoons because they weren't matching up. So yeah. these match up better. All right. And we need one more little piece of tape for the bottom just to hold the spoons together. Can you guys see? I hope so. 
And that's it. I'm going to show you the finished product. Can you guys hear that? Also, you guys, before we go, we want to let you know Miss Doris has a Ziploc bag. And we're going to put all the ingredients you need into a Ziploc bag, and you'll be taking them home next week so you can make your own instrument. The only thing you will need when you get home is some tape. And then you guys should be good to go. Awesome. See you guys next week. So now Miss Doris and I both have one, and we can dance. We hope you guys have fun making your musical instruments. Watch the iHeartRadio, see all your favorite artists, and we will see you guys in soon, in school soon. Bye, guys.